Welcome to Palmer Update TV, the world's first and only TV network with a free petrochemicals news show. At the end of today's daily news report, don't forget to click on the bell icon to subscribe to our free news channel. And if you like today's video, please remember to like this video by giving us a thumbs up. It motivates us to continue to bring you this free informative news service on a daily basis. It's Monday, August 23rd. I am Pratiksha Jaipal. Our special news reel today is sponsored by Surat-based MRK Industries. Let's start with energy and feedstock news. Crude oil prices plunged last Friday on the back of rising pandemic cases globally, inciting fears of a slowdown in demand for oil and fuel. Also, the strengthening of the US dollar, reports of weak Chinese economic data and the United States and China, the largest oil consumers facing a resurgence of the pandemic, leading to dented demand for fuel for the supported the price fall. Brent crude prices slumped by $1.27, settling at $65.18 per barrel, while WTI futures plummeted by $1.37, settling at $62.32 per barrel. Last Friday, open spec NAFTA prices declined by 4 US dollars per metric ton to the 606 US dollars per metric ton CFR Far East Asia levels. Last week, despite a week on week plunge in upstream crude and NAFTA rates, ethylene prices were assessed stable in Asia. Product availability was reported to be sufficient in the region. Last week, despite bearish upstream crude and NAFTA values, propylene prices edged marginally higher in Asia. The price rise was supported by tight regional product availability. Ladies and gentlemen, I would like to quickly tell you about the Polymer Update Academy. At Polymer Update Academy, we provide customized corporate training courses to assist you in expanding your knowledge in the petrochemical, chemical, pharma and allied sectors. The tailor-made courses will be exclusive to each business with renowned professors from the field of education with over 30 years of teaching experience conducting the courses. The objective of the courses is to provide operative professional training for you and your teams to help improve business processes and or products. Back to news now. Let's take a look at futures on China Dalian Commodity Exchange for today. On August 23rd, 2021, LLDPE prices are lower by 5 RMB per metric ton at the 8,140 RMB per metric ton. PP prices are down by 26 RMB per metric ton at the 8,390 RMB per metric ton. PVC prices are lower by 80 RMB per metric ton at the 9,230 RMB per metric ton. In plant news, one work chemical is likely to shut its propane dehydrogenation plant in early September 2021 for a maintenance turnaround. Located in Shandong, China, the PDH plant has a propylene production capacity of 750,000 metric ton per year. Our special news reel today is sponsored by Surat-based MRK Industries. One of the largest sellers of packaging films in India, MRK Industries offers a full range of packaging films from 7 to 70 microns, which includes BOPP films, CPP films, metallized films and PT films. That's all for today's Polymer News. Watch our daily news video tomorrow to know more. It's Monday, August 23rd. I am Pratiksha Jaipal. Thank you. Find us on Facebook at facebook.com slash Polymer Update and be sure to click the like button. You can also find us on Twitter at Polymer Update. For the latest news from the plastics and petrochemicals industry, subscribe to our YouTube channel and do not forget to hit the bell icon.